Bruce Lee's one-inch punch is one of the most iconic and mysterious martial arts techniques ever seen. With just one inch of movement, Bruce Lee could generate enough force to send a person flying backwards. But how did he do it? What was the secret behind this superhuman ability? Today, we're going to break down the science and technique behind Bruce Lee's one-inch punch and reveal how he was able to generate such explosive power in such a short distance. At first glance, the one-inch punch looks almost magical. But when we dive deeper, it's actually based on solid principles of physics and body mechanics. The key lies in kinetic energy transfer. Bruce Lee's punch wasn't just about arm strength, it was about using his entire body to generate force. Kinetic energy equals mass times velocity squared. The secret is in the speed. Kinetic energy depends on velocity more than mass, so even though Bruce Lee was only 135 pounds, the speed of his movements amplified the force. The real power of the one-inch punch comes from the core. Bruce Lee mastered the art of engaging his core muscles and linking them with his legs, hips, and arm in one fluid motion. When he threw the punch, it wasn't just his fist moving forward. His entire body was behind it from the ground up. By rooting his feet, rotating his hips, and snapping his torso forward, Bruce could transfer all that force into a tiny focused movement, creating massive impact in just an inch of space. Speed and precision were also crucial. Bruce Lee trained to punch with incredible speed, using his fast twitch muscle fibers to explode forward in an instant. But speed alone isn't enough. Bruce perfected the ability to strike with pinpoint accuracy, hitting his target at the exact moment his body was fully aligned to deliver maximum force. Speed plus precision equals devastating impact. So how can you train to develop your own one-inch punch? Here are a few exercises and drills you can incorporate into your routine. 1. Short-range striking drills. Focus on delivering punches from a close distance with explosive power. 2. Core strengthening exercises. Try planks, Russian twists, and explosive medicine ball throws. 3. Hip rotation drills. Work on fluid, coordinated hip movement to drive power from the ground up. 4. Punching with resistance. Use resistance bands to build up explosive speed in your punches. Bruce Lee's one-inch punch wasn't just about raw strength. It was a combination of speed, precision, core engagement, and perfect body mechanics. By mastering these elements, he created a technique that seemed almost superhuman. And while it may take years to perfect, anyone can train to improve their own striking power by applying these principles. So next time you see the legendary one-inch punch in action, remember, it's not just about what's happening with the fist. It's about what's happening with the entire body, working together as one. That was Bruce Lee's true secret. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment below with your thoughts. And don't forget to hit that notification bell for more martial arts breakdowns and tips. See you in the next video.